The official wedding photographer, Prince Harry and Meghan Chose, has just arrived at St. George's Chapel. His name is Alexei Lubomirsky. There he is on the right-hand side of your screen, walking with his wife in the seafoam coat. He took, he's a Polish prince himself, by the way. He says so in name only. They call him His Serene Highness. He took the couple's official engagement photos. He's also photographed celebrities like Beyonce, Angelina Jolie, and Julia Roberts. I talked to him yesterday, and I wondered, hey, Alexei, are you a little nervous about today would you describe this as the biggest assignment of your career I think uh, yes three months ago I had the other biggest assignment of my career <laughs> <laughs> yes they keep on coming yes I was more than happy to have done the royal engagement uh, pictures then we were lucky enough my wife and I were lucky enough to be invited to the wedding so that was so you're going again. to the actual wedding yes so we're going to the actual wedding okay how is that going to work physically? What's your what's your game plan physically to get that accomplished? Don't panic. <laughs> um, from the chapel, we while they go on the uh, the carriage ride around Windsor. Um, so we're going to run from the chapel to the uh, the area where we're we're shooting, and um, everything's already set up. Are you nervous? Do you feel pressure? It's funny that with the engagement pictures, nobody knew that I was doing the pictures, so there was zero pressure. This one. Everybody knows, and I'm getting lots of wonderfully lovely comments from around the world via social media. Um, but no, just a healthy amount of nerves and yeah. adrenaline pumping. This whole thing has been an amazing journey, so uh, it's, it, I feel like I've got the whole cake and the cherry on top. So how do you prepare for something like this? You said you've been doing research. How do you prepare? I've been looking at everything from uh, Queen Elizabeth's wedding pictures all the way through to William and Kate's. We're trying to do something a little bit different. Now, when I say different, it can't be completely out there. I think that if this is what is normally done and this is out there, we want to be just around here. We wanted to just make it a bit more authentic, a bit more about them, a bit more real. Tell me the discussions you've had with them about what they want that picture to be and what your vision is for the picture. I've been throwing the word family around in my head a lot. Because it's a, it's a historical document, in general it is quite regimented. There's not much you can get away from. Mm -hmm. But again, I'm just trying to sort of soften the edges a bit. So I'm hopefully trying to get that accent in there, yeah. that flavor. I remember asking when, when they called me with, with the request and I said to them, well, what does it involve? Does it involve me following them around the whole day? And he said, no, no, it's going to take 25 minutes. You can take uh, six pictures. Uh, the first one will be the couple, uh, the parents, the queen, and as soon as he said the queen, everything just blanked out, and I was like... <laughs> Are you allowed to ask her to smile? Uh, I'm, I'm going to try it, you know, <laughs> see what I'll, I'll flash a smile at her and see if she flashes one back. So, <laughs> so you had face-to-face -face meetings with them, or were you on the telephone? Uh, I met uh, the couple um, a couple of weeks ago, and I showed them some ideas about what I wanted to do, and... Uh, they were very open to the ideas, so mm -hmm. obviously we have an extremely short amount of time to get as many pictures in as possible. Now, when you speak with the couple, as you call them, the couple, who does most <laughs> of the talking? Mm, good question. Um, honestly, both of them. They're very at ease with each other. They're in that sort of agreement with everything. They're, they're very sort of one vision about everything. Is there a shot you're looking to capture? Obviously, apart from um, the them together, getting that, that magical shot of them together, I, I'm so looking forward to the to the group photo because I think that is really such a historical document and having Meghan's mum there and is a huge uh, thing, that just gives me goosebumps, the whole thing about how the, the royal family has evolved and how it's moved on and how it's moving with the times. Mm -hmm. And I think it's uh, hugely important and I think it uh, breathes new life into the family and um, yeah, it's wonderful.